Hello and welcome. So I wanted to make a quick uh, blog, vlog, whatever you want to call it, to talk about why I'm not releasing much content on YouTube and not doing many live streams. So the short version is, is simply, I don't have time. Simple as that. I'm working in the middle of London. Um, I get up at six in the morning. I get home after 7 p.m. And I am very tired. So during the week, I don't have much energy left to do it. And um, also as well, I just, I guess the real version, real reason is I just don't enjoy it. It's like, I could use those four hours to release content if I wanted to. I just don't want to. It's simple as that. I don't enjoy it. I don't get the satisfaction I used to out of it. And I will eventually get into it. So I don't want you to feel like this is the end of Mifri. Of course not. It's just a case of um, I'm enjoying playing other games right now. So I, I played Yeez 8. Loved it. You know, I've now got Evil Within 2. Ah, no, I'm kidding. So I'm going to be trying out that game. Then there's South Park Ratchet But Hold. There's Mario Odyssey. I'm actually looking forward to Mario Odyssey. Um, and then there's also Last of Us Part 2. Eventually there's God of War. There's the expansion of Horizon Zero Dawn. There's Final Fantasy 7 Remake. And I've got Final Fantasy 9 on PlayStation 4. Hopefully this one will work properly. Because I had issues with the Steam version and so on so there's so many other things for me to play and this did happen before guys so at the beginning of heaven's ward it was great i loved heaven's ward initially but then there was a drought of content for like five months and then i just started playing loads of other games and um that's all i'm that's all that's it happening right now it's simply um there's a drought of content fine they've released 4.1 but my conclusion and from what i've spoken to people about is that there's literally I thought my guess was three, four hours of story. People are telling me it's more like two, three hours of story. And the housing was gone in 10 minutes on my server. And I know that they're going to be releasing more housing in 4.2. But so, you know, it's like I, I've got other things to do. I'm not going to just sit and wait for three, four months. You know what I mean? I'm going to just keep living my life. And um, I'm not into raiding. I'm not into primals. I'm not into PvP. And crafting, I'm 70 everything. Gill, don't need it. I've made enough gill. You can watch my gill guides. And I did, you know, have ambition to make plenty of gill before 5.0. And I probably still will. It's just there's plenty of time before then. And I'm, I'm, probably, I'm probably a month away in terms of effort from all 70 on Mifri. So, yeah, I'm not in a rush. I just, you know, I'm, I'm sticking to what I feel is fun. That is the main thing, guys. You know, I do this for fun. You know, I don't do this for the money. Any money I make from YouTube, from Twitch, from donations, from anywhere is all put back into the channel, plus some of my own. You know, so I've never made a profit being a content creator. I've always lost money. And I do it simply and purely for the love of games. You know, I love playing games. I love seeing how games are evolving. Games are becoming so good and they're only going to get better because game developers will always see what's been done previously and will then push it further and that's what I'm, I'm really excited about and I also as well got a new uh, webcam I don't know if you can tell the difference in quality or not it's probably because I've got bad lighting in here but I got the Logitech Brio uh, webcam which is apparently capable of 4k but like I said the reason that you might see some graininess um, around is because um, of the lighting in here. This is really, really bad. I need to sort it out. Uh, but it's using HDR to compensate for the bad lighting. And um, as well, guys, um, what can I say? What can I say? It's, uh, it's just the same routine. I'm just living my life, and that's what I encourage all of you to do as well. Don't put all of your hopes up on one thing. That, that It will never work out. Always, you know, don't put all your eggs in one basket, as they say. There's more to life than 14. There's more to life than any one aspect of it. Life is about everything involved. And I'm happy with the situation I'm in. Um, I've finally tidied up my room. Though I'll do a room tour later, you know, like how I've updated it. And because it's a li little, little bit messy right now. And also as well, I am a lot healthier. So now I'm walking a good 20 miles a week back and forth to work. And, you know, so I walk... Rather than take the train, which is right next to my house, I walk a mile to the next stop of the train line. And then when I get to 
London Bridge, I, rather than take the underground train to the office, I walk from London Bridge to the office, which is another mile. So I do that, you know, each way every day, um, five days a week. So I feel a lot healthier. I feel a lot more relaxed. There's no pressure. And I am, like I said, I am very much looking forward to these games. But um, also as well, guys, um, I am questioning the future of this. You know, I've said it in my posts recently. You've seen it on Twitter. You might have seen it on YouTube as well. Is the fact that I am very, very aware of the fact in a couple of months I'm going to be 33 years old. And I will never give up games. I want you to understand that. I'll always enjoy having fun. How can you ever grow out of having fun? But um, there's no future in this for me personally. I'm not going to. This will never be my job. I will never make enough money from this to support myself. And I wouldn't want to either because I've already said in the other video that every moment you're a full-time streamer, you're diminishing your future in terms of career. You know, you are leaving a massive gap in your CV resume, which you can't fill. And the thing is as well, all the, the last three jobs I've had, they scrutinize your job history to the letter. Every day they want to know what you were doing. Between this day and this day, what were you working on? Between that day and that day, what were you working on? You know, what was your job history? Where was your employment? Where were your references? And so on and so on. And thankfully, I've got a good, say, 10 years experience behind me. You know, job, 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 job. And I've only got little tiny gaps. And those little tiny gaps make me nervous. Just the little tiny gaps. So I would hate to be in a position where I haven't had a job for like five years. What have you been doing for five years? Uh, oh, I've been making content on YouTube or Twitch. I've been making money playing games. Get out. You know, that that's what I'm worried about will happen. You know, it's not stable. It's not future. I wouldn't, you know, put all of my eggs on in one basket in, in that regard, you know. It's wonderful doing it as a hobby. I want you to understand. So I don't want to diminish the idea of being a full-time streamer. People do it. Maybe it's their only option. People love doing it. Great. But I'm a realist. I'm thinking long-term. I'm thinking about my life. I'm not thinking about now, 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 you know. So 10 years from now, hopefully I'll still be doing it as a hobby. You know, I'll be playing the games, enjoying it, growing old with my community. Sorry to say. <laughs> but... And maybe some people will stick around, maybe some people won't. But, you know, the older I get, the more perspective I'm getting. And I think that's just natural. Now, the thing is as well, guys, I'm only 32. I have plenty more stuff to learn. You know, I'm also a realist in that regard. I know full well that I'm, you know, just now understanding some basic stuff. But at the same time... I don't want people to ruin their lives. I really don't. Just because some streamers are making lots of money now, like I said, that's the question. 10 years from now, what will you do when you have no job experience? And um, each person has their own point of view. I get it, you know? So you don't have to agree with me. I'm not right. I'm just explaining my opinion. So I want you to understand that. Because some people think that when I say something, I'm saying it like it's fact. I'm not saying facts, I'm saying my opinion of the world. So in my opinion, this is not a safe thing to gamble on. And um, as well, guys, you know, more to prove the point, like that I do this for fun, is the fact that when anything else comes along, which is more fun, I do that. Then, and I stop this, you know what I mean? So like, there's plenty of big streamers, plenty of people make all of their money from online, from Twitch, from YouTube, from whatever, who will tell you this line. It's like, oh, if you get into streaming because you do want it for the money, you're doing it for the wrong reason. Now, let me just go to the bank and cash the $5,000 I made this month. Tee -hee -hee. You know what I mean? There's a, a double standard there, which I just find ridiculous. <laughs> I actually find it hilarious. Now, um, like I say, guys, you know, I do this for fun, 100% for fun. If it's not fun, then, you know, I won't do it. And also as well, guys, it's a reason I have no problem blocking and banning every 
person who does anything slightly negative, troll anything, even if I block 99% of the internet, I don't care. I do this because I love doing this. If anyone tries to diminish that fun, bye. That's it. You know, you're not going to diminish what I do. I do this because I enjoy it. If you don't like it, leave. You know, I'm not going to change my life for you. I do this for me. 100% me. And that's what I encourage other people to do as well. Focus on yourself. Don't focus on other people. Don't be jealous. Don't be, you know, obsessed. Don't be whatever. Everyone's doing what they can to support themselves. Everyone is doing what they can to live and enjoy their life. Don't put and don't try and change anyone. The only person you should be trying to change or improve is yourself. That's it. So now in terms of the future, like I say, I'm going to be trying Evil Within 2. I'm going to be playing hopefully South Park Fractured Butthole. I will eventually miss 14. I'm sure I will and I'll get back into the content I'm making it. But, you know, for now, I'm just taking a break. You know, it's like I played World of Warcraft for eight years. I quit World of Warcraft eight times in that eight years. It, it's, it happens, you know, it's just realistic. Things I'm looking forward to, I'm looking forward to all those games. I'm looking forward to getting a third screen. I'm looking forward to getting a new graphics card. I am really excited for the games coming out, you know, so, and I'm going to love sharing them with you guys. Even if I get, you know, sometimes I can have 10 people to my live stream. Some people I can have 2,500, you know. As long as I'm having fun, fine. That's all I care about. If I'm not having fun, guys, you've seen me. I'm prone to rage quitting. <laughs> I've rage quit more than once. If I'm not enjoying a game, by game even. <laughs> so, and, you know, people find my rage quitting kind of funny. But it's not funny to me. <laughs> If a game really, really angers me, then it will put me in a bad mood for the whole day of how poorly it was made. I'm not going to bash any games uh, in this video, but, you know, I, I do get kind of hot-headed sometimes about things. I guess I wear, as I say, you know, my heart on my sleeve. And um, going forward as well, guys, um, you know, I am a couple of months away now from being completely debt-free. That is going to be a, the biggest relief of my life. It'll be the first time I've been debt-free in... God, how many years now? Maybe 12... 14 years. I'm 32. So the last 14 years I've been in debt. Whether it was student debt, my ex's debt, which you guys know about, I don't need to repeat, or whatever. 14 years I've been in debt. And... Even if I become debt free, I don't have a mortgage. So, like, let's say I've really enjoyed the pre mortgage, I'll, I'll say the pre mortgage part of my life a bit too much. And I, I'm paying the price for it, literally. But um, it's just, like I say, guys, it's just peace of mind. I'm after Zen, I'm after relaxation. You know, this game, God. I'm look this game is like, you know, it's gonna attack me. It's just like Ugh! It's, it's probably gonna stress me the hell out Like the last time I played any game that was slightly scary was dying light and that stressed the hell out of me <laughs> but um, We will see I like that. It's like face disturbing enemies so yeah, but um, I'll try it. I'll see how it is if I who knows maybe you know I'll really get into the scary games. I've never really given them a proper try. But, yeah. And, um... Like I say, guys. If you have any opinion or any suggestion, constructive suggestion of anything that I can do to make this more fun or more efficient, then tell me. L let me know in the comments down below. If you troll me, you'll get banned. So, if you have only negative things to say without any constructive feedback, piss off. That's the nice... This, I don't even have to be nice about it. I do this for fun. I don't do this for acceptance. I don't do this for money. I don't do this for anything. I don't need anyone's acceptance from anyone. Let's be very, very clear. The only person I need acceptance from is me. So, and... You know, going beyond that, guys. Um, just to make a quick comment about it. The latest Twitter drama which apparently I was involved in. Just, that's my response. 
Like, really. So the people who have been blocked, they're going to be permanently blocked. Just for the same reason I block any troll. It's a simpler case of that. If you're butthurt and sensitive about nothing, I want you nowhere near me. I have no time for you. I literally don't. I'm here to enjoy myself. So if you limit my enjoyment, go away. That's the, the nicest way I'll, I'll say it. And um, as well, guys, just believe things will be better. Like I know that people have um, difficulties in their life. We all do. Some more than others. But just believe. Believe things will get better. You can't force some things. You know, there's some, there's some things you just can't control. So just ride it out and then believe it will get better. And also as well, everything that you can control, do what you can to make things better for yourself. So like I say, I've got a better job. So that was a problem in my life. I'm doing what I can to improve my health. You know, my room is the best it's ever been in terms of layout, everything is convenient and so on. I am really looking forward to the future. I've actually, just so you know guys as well, I've actually pre-ordered an Xbox One X. Now, I know that some people are very kind of iffy about it, but I've never owned an Xbox One. So um, I, I'm going to give Microsoft the benefit of the doubt this time. I will try it out. There's some games I want to play on Xbox as well, like Halo, Gears of War and so on. And these days, to be honest, I, I've been coming, even though I used to be 100% before PC Master Race, um, now I'm more getting into the console games. And the reason why is because they just work. That's the thing. I don't have time for technical issues. <laughs> I've been talking about it for a long time. I, I really don't. So, you know, um, I do really appreciate... For example, another Bethesda game before Evil Within 2 was Prey. Now, I was really, really disappointed and sad that my GTX 970 graphics card could barely run Prey. You know, it's a 970. It's a very good graphics card. And I was really sad that it was just... It just didn't work out. So when I upgrade my graphics card, I will be going through Prey. I will be playing it. And, you know, big thank you to Bethesda for sending me that game for free. I personally want to say I'm very sorry for not providing the coverage that the game deserved. I just didn't have the setup. I regret just not requesting a code on PS4. I really, that, that way... That's how I feel about it. And I do want to give a thank you to all the publishers and all the game studios who have ever sent me games. So Bandi, uh, Bandai Namco, Square Enix, obviously we've said, Bethesda, um, and then um, who else has sent me games? There's been, a, there's been a few. There's been a few who have sent me games. So thank you very much. I'm now trying to establish a relationship with Ubisoft as well. So if that works out, great. And then Nintendo will never partner with someone like me. I'm not I'm a small fish, you know. So I, I would have to be a, a whale before they um, contact me. But I love Nintendo. I love everything they do. I love all the games they've made. The Nintendo Switch is probably the best console they've ever made. If they make a Nintendo 64 Classic, that is the one of the classic consoles that I will be, you know, desperate for. I wasn't overly enthusiastic about the, the NES or the SNES, but I never was originally. But if they release a Nintendo... Imagine it, guys. You know, this is like game... Um, dream. I don't want to use any other words. A dream for most gamers. A Nintendo 64 Classic with Mario 64, Ocarina of Time, Majora's Mask, GoldenEye, Mario Kart, maybe even Donkey Kong, who knows. Imagine that being released by Nintendo. Oh my god. <laughs> so I hope and pray that that becomes a thing. I really, really do. And um, yeah, so okay guys, so I, I know I've been ranting on for a while, but short version I'm only doing what I enjoy. I will get back to 14 content eventually. I will not put a schedule. I will not put a deadline on that. When I miss it, I will start playing it again. And, um, you know, in the meantime, I hope you enjoy the other games I cover. If you don't, there's plenty of other streamers to see. So I can recommend some for you. You can watch uh, Sly, aka Grey Fox. You can watch Cerno, 
TV on Twitch. You can watch Tin the Tap Man. You can watch Stella Elf. You can watch Inochi um, Fantasy. You can watch. There are so many streamers. You can watch Clintus. You can watch Kang Gaming. And all the people I'm mentioning, they are friends of mine. So, you know, hi, other streamers. So, um, plenty of other streamers to check out other than me. So, don't bring in any negativity towards me. I'm doing what I enjoy, I'm doing what I love. And, you know, I really want to keep this going. But right now, it's a quiet period. Simple as that. We'll look back at this. Oh, do you remember those few months when it was quiet on your channel? It's like, yeah, cool. Now it's not. So, you know, just in enjoy the, the calm. You know, enjoy the holiday from the Mifri. And I will see you with Evil Within 2. So, thank you guys. And I will see you next time. Bye-bye.